When you're done with the pizza, you put everything except the cheese in here with the cheese. So you've got all of your Mediterranean ingredients, your artichoke hearts, your olives, your capers, your herbs, your tomato sauce. And then put this in the oven the minute the pizza comes out. Put your thing in there. Yeah, this is this is really nice. I, I like I love it when you get that char and and Christmas on it. And let me slice off a little piece. So I got my little piece of skin. Yeah. So I'm gonna separate that. Uh -huh. It's like my Peking duck. And you're gonna take that. I'm gonna get that little <laughs> fillet right there. Now, how much of the the coloring? Some of this is from the olives. Do you think, or is it all just from the the roasted roasting in the oven? I think it's from the roasting in the oven because um, you know, in a little bit, a little bit of mm. the tomato glaze on there, and dill basil would go on at the end and really brighten it up again. And you've got the lemon in there that yeah. kind of yeah. got all yeah. together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Getting that, that mm -hmm. little lemon oil hint. Yeah. Yeah. And then that little crisp skin. Love yeah. that crisp skin. I mean, a, lot and this, a lot of times when we do this, we use pancetta and everything else on the on the, mm -hmm. on the pizzas, so that gets in there and gets really mm -hmm. crisp. As Bridget said, I think her next vlog is called The Crispy Bit. Is what she the Crispy yeah. Bit, I like it. Good name, good name. Bridget, this is great. Casey, thank you so much. Pleasure. You must have a lot of fun cooking together. Thank and you so much, Peter. Doing a, and, and you're at Refugio, you do what class, do you do classes or events there? Or? We do both, we do classes and uh, events. We had a winery come to bring all of their distributors and have a big uh, Pinot camp for cooking nice. lessons and then nice. they had dinner. We brought chefs over from Italy, from San Francisco. There's a guy coming down to do a sauce Class. I mean, the point is, is it's not just a, an ego-driven thing. It's yeah. about education. It's about yes. food. It's about mm -hmm. lifestyle. Well, and we always have a winemaker pouring. Nice. There's never a class without a winery, and often the actual winemaker is there pairing and That's pouring true. the okay. wines with the classes. Yeah. So I will see you in Paso Robles, but I will I see you back. So. I'll see you back here in a little bit. Bridget and Casey. Thank nice. you, Peter.